Here's a presentation of Milgram's Mixed Reality Continuum. And this shows you the four main modes that make up this continuum. How we go from reality on the left hand side right through to uh, virtual reality on the far right hand side. And the two main phase modes in between. If we have a look at what's presented in front of us at the moment, this is a virtual scene. So this is a 360 or VR type experience. It has some virtual objects in there and you can interact with these easily. And of course you can put this into stereo mode so you can experience this through some sort of head mounted display experience. To the left of that we see augmented virtuality and that's the same sort of scene but with um, sensor data so the camera view in this example projected into the scene. Of course that sensor data doesn't have to be just cameras you could project other sensor data in there as well. And on the far left hand side as we said this is reality. So this is just the plain standard view of the real world and if we hold up markers or those sorts of things nothing happens this is just the general view of the world. This is the, the meat space that we live in. But if we turn on augmented reality we can see that tracking is now possible and the digital content is overlaid onto the markers or objects that it sees. So this is how augmented reality works, overlaying digital content onto the real world. But because that's really just one type of sensor data, as we said, we can project that back into the augmented virtuality scene as well. And so if we hide that, this still allows us to move an object using this marker around inside that 3D virtual space. And we could use other sensor data from mobile devices and those sorts of things as well. And then back to the full virtual experience where everything is just coming from the virtual environment. Um, this is virtual reality. This really shows the four main modes of Milgram's Mixed Reality Continuum all working. And the key thing here is that this is all working just inside a web browser.